Hello everybody and welcome to Solid Code. In this video I'm going to show you how to install and start using the PBRT project. We are going to work with the version number 3 and we are going to do the installation on Windows. So first of all you have to go to the repository page. I'm going to put the link down in the, in the description of the video. Then we go down here, we copy this command and I'm going to clone it on my desktop. You can clone it wherever you want. And since I'm on Windows, I'm going to remove this dollar sign. So it is cloning. Once it's finished, we are going to open the project and we are going to create a new folder. We're going to name it build for now. And we're going to download the rest of the things that we need. So we need Python. You just have to go here and you can download the most recent version and you need a version 3. That's something to have in mind. I'm not going to install it because I already have it and also we need to uh, download CMake. So we go to this link right here, it's going to be in the description as well and we click on this and we are going to install CMake. Once it's downloaded, we are going to click. So next, accept the terms. And let's add CMake to the system path for all users. And install. Okay, it is installed. And we are going to continue with Visual Studio. We are going to allow, download the community version because uh, we don't need the other versions, just the free one. And we are going to install it. Okay, we are going to click on next. Okay, so now we are here. And let's install just what we need. We don't need Azure. We don't need this. This, I'm not that sure, so I'm going to leave it there. But what we need is C++. Actually, let's remove that net. It's not necessary. And I think that's, yeah, what we most need is C++ compilers. So uh, let's leave it like that. And in here in optional, let's see what we can delete. This one we don't need it. Let's see if we can make this uh, smaller. I think we don't need this. Okay. I think. That's just it. So uh, let's install it. That's gonna take a while. Uh, so now it has it has finished. So we're going to test it. 2022. So there it is. Let's continue without the code. Okay, so now we are there. I'm going to close this. And now I want to check something in help about Microsoft Visual Studio. And what I want to see is the version, so it's 17. Okay, so now we are going to go back to the build. And in the CMD console, we on the folder build, we are going to use this command. Okay, now that it's finished, we are going to run the following command. Okay, now that it's finished, we have to go to the SRC folder, sorry, the release one. And here, there is going to be the executable. So now, let's see how we can use this project. So. Now, in order to use it, we need to open a command prompt on the release folder 
and we are going to type the following command. So it's going to be using the pbrt.exe and we have to give him a scene that is a file describing the scene. So I'm using the one that is uh, by default in the project is this one right here, scenes and killer simple. There is there. And now let's go back to build so we can see the image being generated. Yeah, okay. So we enter and now it's rendering. Once it finishes, you will see the image here and you need to open it. I'm using an app special to open it and it's the file viewer plus. I found it on the Microsoft store and it's free. So I'm using it and here I can see the image now. And there it is. So guys, thanks for watching. Uh, please subscribe and I hope that the video helps you. Give us a like and I will try to record a video in a few days in order to install this project on Linux. So thanks for watching and bye.